Hey guys, it's Katie at scrappinkatie.ctmh.com and Close to My Heart has a special for the month of May 2020 called Blue Skies. Now there are several kit options, but today I'm going to walk you through the Blue Skies Cut Above kit, which makes two two-page layouts. Everything is cut for you. All you need to do is add adhesive. We also have a card kit. We have a full scrapbooking kit, and then we also have a six by eight album kit. So here is a look at the Cut Above kit. Now um, I am going to unpackage it for you just to show you what you get. And so in this bag, not only will you get all the paper and, and, and a fully illustrated instruction guide, but you also get all the pre-cut pieces for that as well, including photo mats and photo placeholders. You will also get memory protectors so you can put these pages immediately into your album. So I'm going to set those pieces aside and walk you through the fully illustrated color guide that comes with the Cut Above kit. So here is a look at the two two-page layouts. So we've got layout one and layout two, and then each layout has instructions and steps for you to take in which order to take them just to kind of make it easy for you. So I am going to really speed this up, but I have put a screenshot down um, in the corner showing you how fast this really took in real time, which was only 30 minutes. That is not much in the scrapbooking world. So for this die cut sheet, I've gone ahead and separated the pieces for layout number one, and then I am just following the instructions, which is to place this rainbow an inch from the top. Now, I just eyeballed it, but if you wanted to pull out a ruler, you definitely could measure it that way. And then the next step was to take all the clouds from the sticker sheet. Now, that sticker sheet is also blocked out for layouts one and layout two, so there's no guesswork. Um, it will show you what stickers go with which layout, and then you can just follow the instructions. And or if you are a per, uh, picture person like I am, you can just follow the photo. So I'm just going to adhere these photo mats down. Now I have not added photos yet to these layouts, so you'll want to watch my blog as well as my social media outlets to see which photos I choose for this and how those come together. So I am adding some 3D foam tape to some of these elements. I just love to add dimension by doing that. Any stickers that go over the photo wells, I am taking the sticky off using my anti-static pouch, and then that makes it easy for me to add photos at a later date. So on these stars, I am adding 3D foam adhesive to some of those die cut stars, and then just following the pictures and the instructions to adhere that down, and this layout is almost done. So the Cut Aboves, if you are a um, subscriber to our um, Craft With Heart subscription, we have a layout subscription and a card subscription. These Cut Aboves basically are what you get with those subs subscriptions, pardon me. Um, it makes it really easy. I love to use them to um, catch up on scrapbooking. I know that our first son um, pretty much has a completed album. Um, but our two middle children do not. Now, my daughter has a whole lot of photos because she always likes to take photos and then she begs me to make a scrapbook layout. Um, our two middle sons, they've got other things and better things to do than hang out with their mama and ask about photos. So you can see that this layout number two is coming together rather quickly. And I am just following the instructions and the pictures now, I just love these houses. They are so adorable. Some of them are stickers, and those are the ones I'm pulling off of that sticker sheet. And then some of them were the die cuts. So I'm just placing the die cuts where they would go. And then I'm going to add 3D foam adhesive to the back of those and then adhere those down just to kind of add some dimension between that row of houses. So now I'm going to work on the title. I am uh, just using my paper piercer to gently peel that title from the carrier sheet. And then that G is going to hang over the photo wells. I'm just taking the sticky off with my anti-static pouch so I can add my photo later. So these houses are going mm -hmm. to also be glued down pretty quickly. And then again, I'm just using 3D foam tape. Any of the houses that are going over a photo well, I'm making sure that 3D foam tape is not over that place where I'm going to put the photo. 
And then for this cloud and this hot air balloon, I am adding some dimension by using the 3D foam squares that come with our shaker cards. They are a little thicker, and so I like that dimension. And then I'm just going to add just a couple more little details, and then that's your four pages, ladies. Um, again, I will leave the link down below. If you have any questions, please feel free to ask. And again, this uh, special is only available through the end of May 2020. Thank you so much for stopping by and watching. Please subscribe and sign up for notifications so you'll be notified the next time I post a crafty video. And don't forget to check out the links below for the Blue Skies collection and all the project kits that you could purchase through the end of May.